so we can start properly playing Bowser's Fury resume. Okay, I'm gonna take this cat back. Oh, oh, it's here. It's here. No, 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 no. The game will never end. What do you mean the game will never end? Sure, it'll end sometime. Will I let it end? Is it like Odyssey, where it has 999 moves? Alright. Bringing the kitty back. Oh, we never counted the... You know, hammerhead sharks. That are cats. We gotta put that on the list. Cat sharks. Oh, I would hate to lose this cat here. No! 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 like self-fulfilling prophecy. Well... Did I speed up? Okay, let's see. That is the one complaint I'll make about this game. The camera's not very good. Usually Mario games have the best camera. This game does not. <laughs> this game does not turn with you. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. No. <laughs> Okay, perfect timing. Oh, I didn't know I could turn the camera like that. That would have been useful. No way, Luigi's appear here? I thought we were free of year of Luigi. Um, one thing that I have been putting a lot of thought into is the... The whole... Okay, okay. Actually, I'm, I'm gonna focus here. I don't want any disasters. Are you serious? There we go. And here you go, big mama. I know I just chuck. Okay. Okay, I was like, did the game just break? Oh, oh, oh. How in the world does the island change when I'm not looking? When does that happen? Okay. This, all right. This is a cool way to innovate on the Boom Boom, but like, again, Boom Boom's still the easiest boss ever made. I say that as I'm dying. We're good. We're okay. All right, boom, boom. You're down. We should have a hidden Luigi counter. Luigi sucks, man. Get Luigi out of here. How are you doing? How are you doing, Jack? What? You're Luigi's? I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed. How can you guys like Luigi? He's the loser one. He's the... Is that cat shine just chilling? Okay. Okay. I love my bean pole. How can you not? I am disappointed. He's Loogie! How can you like Loogie? Oh, he does it go. Mario! Mario! Imagine the day I played Luigi's Mansion. The day I play Luigi's Mansion, because I don't play that. Well, I played the first one, but. It'll probably be like a torture. Uh, maybe I'll, I'll have to make it like a, an incentive or something, because I won't do it <laughs> out of my own will. He loves his bro. That, that's a weak answer. It was the Mario and Luigi RPGs, man, that won me over back in the day. See, that's how they get you. They try to make him the lovable goof. The inferior lovable goof. But, like, that's his whole thing, though. He can't do anything right. 
Side note, your character impressions are a bit too on point. <laughs> Did I do any? I'm not even realizing. Oh no. I'm going too far. I, I remember playing... Um... Mario and Luigi Partners in Time. And I, I really love that game. Partners in Time is fantastic. I, I never played any of the other ones. Shame about Alpha. Oh, yeah, what happened? They got dismantled, right? They closed. Or something. They made the best RPGs. They were so okay, I lied. My favorite Mario RPG is Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. That game is probably the best Mario RPG. One of my favorite. Oh, I got all of them. Probably my favorite Mario RPG, period. Granted, it's probably because I grew up on it, but I still do think it's a solid. I mean, a lot of people do think that that one's a solid to them. Probably means something, right? <laughs> and you'd think that, like, they'd be part of Nintendo or something. Bankruptcy. And yeah, Paper Mario is great. Bug Fables is pretty solid in terms of success. Bug Fables? Oh yeah, I remember hearing about that. It was like, done in the style of... ...of Paper Mario. But it like, maintained its nice RPG roots instead of going to a more card-based system. So yeah, that- oh. That is also something I saw today about this game, and about the remake of 3D World, is that they added, so, a lot of the things that I was talking about when we were playing, um, 3D World, I was like, wow, they have all the moves that they have in Odyssey. I guess this is what created them. But, actually, they added the moves from Odyssey into 3D World, and I didn't know about that. I thought that this game is, was the one who introduced, like, the roll and jump technique that, you know, everyone uses in... Uh, uses in an Odyssey. But no, they added it to the remake, specifically. So, credit goes away from 3D World one more time. <laughs> that game doesn't catch a break. I feel like they put their best songs on the islands that you're probably going to be in the most time, so like the longest ones they give you. They're, they're 10 out of 10 songs, not that any of them are bad, because, you know, when is a Nintendo song bad? When is a Mario song bad? And that, <laughs> that correction is important, because there's a really bad soundtrack called Yoshi's Woolly World. <laughs> it's horrendous. <laughs> If you've never listened to it, I recommend... Uh, actually, I'd recommend you not to, because it's, it's terrible, but... <gasps> How do I get rid of this box? How do I get rid of this box? I want to get rid of it! Let me get out of the box! Okay, I'm gonna hit myself. I'm gonna hit myself. Yes! Okay, 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 okay. Here we go, here we go. So satisfying. Perspective. Oh, we missed Bowser again. All right, so I'm actually, cause I, I'm not exactly sure where the rest are. So oh, can I land on Plessy? I can see my shadow from here. Land on Plessy. Can I do it? What's oh, gonna happen? It's gonna happen. Yes. Also, Plessy's on. We gotta get all of them. No, oh, I failed completely. This is a new land. Are the cats... Are, the, are those cats playing with the ball? Okay. <gasps> There's so many cats here! How many cats do you want, Mama? Five. After you sent that message, Erica, now I'd never see these things the same way. These cats. You've ruined the cats for me. 
don't know what I'm talking about. Well, I was gonna say check the Discord, but maybe you don't want to. Maybe you don't want to have the cats ruined for you. This is like a cat sanctuary. I wonder why there's so many cats in this game. What if Bowser's whole deal was that he's stealing cats? What if that's his whole thing in this game? Like, that's the untold story, because what in the world is happening? All we know in this story is that we fell through a goop thing made by Bowser Jr. And now we're in this world. We don't know where this world is. Is this a painted world, just like in Dark Souls? Is this secretly connected to Dark Souls? Like, there's so many unanswered questions in this game. <laughs> About... No. My nightmares return. Dark Luigi. Let's see Dark Luigi. Ah, uh, see? Luigi sucks! Right, come on, Bowser. Bring it. Where is he? Where is he? Oh, you're behind the thing. You're not gonna hit me. Can he hit me? No! Bowser, move! There, where is he? there we go. I do have a question for everyone. What is your favorite Mario game? I know that you all love Luigi, but we'll see if we're all gonna get Luigi-related answers. Uh, it, to me, it's between... This is so hard. Sunshine holds the most nostalgia for me. I don't think it's the best one. For me, it's between Odyssey and 64. I love the open, open style. Cause yeah, to me, I think the best Mario's are the ones where they do give you the liberty to do it your way. I think in Gal and Galaxy, all these games are fantastic. It's not like I'm, I'm picking one because the others are bad, and I'm sure everyone, <laughs> everyone, thinks the same. There. It's definitely not picking because it's bad. It's more picking, just because that's, I guess, what humans do. <laughs> um, but... When they give you the liberty, it's so awesome, and you can definitely see it in in speedruns. And as everyone probably knows at this point, I love me some good speedruns. But it just allows for so much creativity in the play, which is awesome. I don't think I don't think when you have such a concert, you can make some beautiful levels when you have so much control over it. Like, so much control over the, what the, the player should do. Like they do in 3D World and Galaxy and those games. But, I just, the freedom is to me the, the best part of a Mario game. The freedom to figure out your own route. That to me is just like paramount to, to why I love Mario games. Bowser grilling his own son. Yeah, he doesn't care. Bowser don't care. But yeah, that's why I think there's there's a secret in this plot. This might be the Mario with the thickest plot. Like, what is going on here? What is the story we're not being told? What did Miyamoto did Miyamoto hire Kojima to write this game? That's what we discover at the end of the game, it's just like, written by Kojima, <laughs> that would be the weirdest Mario game. <laughs> but actually, I'd play that. I'd play that game. I mean, who wouldn't, honestly? 45. I wonder how many shines there are in this game. Because the classic Mario thing is 120, but I... I don't know. They could, because this is... 
this is very much, it's as if Odyssey had 120 instead of 900, so it, it just makes for a much shorter game, but I feel like they might. <laughs> I feel like they might have something like that. Which would be insane at the same time, it would make sense. But yeah, I, I love just the variety, the pure variety in this game. It's short, but it like it's never boring. And that's like something. I feel like so many games, and like I've I've been looking at making my own game and stuff like that. I have been <laughs> making my own game for a while, and it's sometimes so hard to innovate on your on your mechanics in a way that will last a full game. So you know something that won't become boring and won't become annoying for the player after a while. So like be able and I just think that it starts from the base with Mario, right? Like the base is so universal. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Screw you! No! Mario! Why? Okay. I'll take it slow. Yeah, I didn't even die to the. And no! <sighs> Mario. Uh oh. Mario, it's starting to rain. We haven't gotten the key. All we wanted was the key. We've gotten so close to it, like 15 times now. That's an extreme exaggeration. Now I have to do it with Bowser. Oh, he's right there! He's right there! <laughs> no! <laughs> and I'm Baby Mario. Oh no. This is gonna go bad. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, 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 okay. We're there. No, Mario! Why? Why are you doing this to me? Why, Mario? I'm done with it. I'm getting the Gigabell. I'm fighting Bowser. Give me the cat. Give me the cat power! It's time to fight. I'm done. I'm done with Mario and his shenanigans. Oh, Bowser has two thirds of his life bar and he has a big life bar now. Screw you, Bowser. Oh, you're throwing dumb torpedoes at my butt? Screw you. Oh, now you're running away. Old items. What can I pull? Oh! Kaiju battle! It's like I'm... Oh, it's like I'm carrying a building. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> I kind of love that. <laughs> I kind of love that. Oh yeah, go retreat, Bowser. Screw you, I'm skipping your dumb cuts. Plessy! Looks like Bowser Jr. has more to say. I can't believe how big and strong Dad is now. Fighting him gets scarier and scarier every time he appears. I know he will take him back to regular scary if we keep trying. We can't give up now. All right. Baby Bowser. Wait, how much money now? How much? 50? We're almost there. Let's see shine. I am carrying a cat accidentally. Cat, do not jump to your doom with me. Okay. Bowser, what are you doing? This just happened. 
Bowser. You didn't even give me time to breathe. Screw you, Bowser! <laughs> Regular scary is how I wake up. Oh! <laughs> Did we do it? The beast's fury has grown too strong. The light of the cat shines can no longer keep it at bay? Oh boy. Uh-oh. Um... Uh-oh. Uh That's bad. You need to stay underwater. <laughs> I love that you can do that. Okay, we gotta, um... So... We don't really have a solution for this problem. Evil cat! No! So... What, how, how... Can we deal with this? <laughs> um... So shines don't do it anymore. It's good to know. I guess I just gotta keep keep going because the only way is doing the bell. Getting over the balls. Okay, 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 okay. No. Ooh, that was that was. I thought I I didn't get it. <laughs> I'm surprised I got it. We just need to keep going. Keep going, keep going. D does the ba is the Bowser Fury just gonna keep going now? I should not. I should not have. <laughs> I should not have done that fight. This is the worst. Cause now I gotta do all the things with Bowser on my back. Just. D what? No. I have full battery. Game, don't don't you do it. <laughs> don't. No. Okay, 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 okay. Go. This is hard, Nintendo. I wanted an easy game. <laughs> Okay, we got it, we got it. Okay, okay. There are platforms. Make it, make it, make it! Yes! Okay, okay, this is a good angle. I can see where I'm going! No! <laughs> I, I guess I'm gonna have to fight him. There's nothing else I can do. Oh, right next to a Giga Bell. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, give me more ammo. That's it. That's it. Yeah! Cheers to you, my friend. It's happening. It's happening. I think we did it. And this is it. Oh, yeah, unless it can go underwater. Come on. Ooh. Yes. 
Where's he going? Where's he going? All right, all right. We're going up. We're going up. No. One more, one more. Let's go. Not a three. Oh, oh, oh. Are you serious? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Plessy can fly? Plessy cat? <laughs> what am I watching? What is this, Looney Tunes? <laughs> Yeah, Mario, same. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. That was good! <laughs> I... I think I can say with confidence that this is that was the best final Bowser fight in most other games they're just a rehash of previous fights maybe with something added on usually they add something on but this was just fresh it was new it felt awesome and it wasn't throwing something unexpected at you in a way that you wouldn't know what to do. They taught you everything you needed to know before you did it. So it wasn't something like, oh, they just threw something brand new and you don't know what to do. So, so it was good. It was like good game design. Oh, it's telling the story of what, yeah, Bowser Jr. totally did it. I think that with the other things that it did, with making it just one full world that you explore and you don't have to wait for loading screens, you don't have to wait for anything. That's also awesome. And I think very much, I know that other people have mentioned this before, but I think it's very much an indication of, the, of where Mario is going towards now. And I think that they will build more and more towards something like this, where, but instead of being a smaller game like this, it'll be a bigger game. Like, like Odyssey or something, but where you don't have to load at all. Everything is interconnected. How awesome would that be? 50 out of 100. There's a lot. There's a lot.
did the microphone just pick up my burp? <laughs> Dad and I were supposed to have fun, a fun day on this lake together, but then you got all big and mad. I put marks on the map where more cat signs might be hiding. Let's find them all and send Dad back. Okay. Yeah, this is very much like post game. Not. This isn't. Listen up, Mario. You're helping me a lot, so I'm gonna make it easy on you. If you want to visit different islands, you point to it in the map and you press A, and I'll walk you straight there. Yeah. So like they can't they can't make the narrative make sense <laughs> anymore. But yeah, this this is one of the best Mario games. It's not my favorite, but I think especially in innovation and creativity, it it's definitely up there. It is an awesome Mario game. If you are a Mario fan, and you're not playing this, you, you're you missing out on the next Mario game. Straight up. This is awesome. This is fantastic. That's impressive. Like, even the final boss to me was unexpected in the best of ways. And I, I really commend them for, for doing that. Aw, this is cute. I commend them for doing that because it is, like I mentioned, it's unprecedented in a Mario game. So, final boss was fantastic, and you know, the, you could always say that Mario games endings aren't good, and they're always, and yeah, this one is no different than any other Mario ending. It's it's just there to be there. It's, it's Mario games are much more about the journey. They're very much more about the journey than the end because you're there isn't really anything at the end usually. <laughs> so, but this is one of the oh no, plus he's a cat. Okay, we gotta add it. The cat count thirty two. I counted thirty two cat things. All right. Yeah, thank you for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this game. It, to me, it, it's one of my favorites. <laughs> it's one of my favorites. And, yeah, that's it. So, <laughs> thank you for watching. And I will see you in a few moments with some Valheim. Get to chill a little bit with Valheim tonight. So, I will see you there. some new stuff. Okay, I'm not, not even gonna... <laughs> Enjoy the, the nice chill background tunes here. While I prepare our next game.